like I said earlier, I'm going to do uh, a campaign trail instead of chap uh, chapter 6 of uh, President's Men. So yeah, I'm going to do um, Republic. This is the only foreign... In the campaign trail, so far, as of uh, July 2022, this is the only campaign where you play as a foreign nation, technically. Because this is the Republic of Texas. So yeah, Texas... Mo a lot of most people, especially in the U.S., know Texas was a country at one point. But so the newly reborn Repu Republic of Texas is set to elect its first president in the fall of 1836. Father of Texas, Stephen F. Austin, is running to become the per first popularly elected governor president of the Republic of Texas. Henry Smith, the short tenured governor of Texas's provisional government. Is almost is also in the running. Branch T. Arthur, former chairman of the provisional government, has been entered in the contest by his friends. Some voters wish to see the war hero and former governor of Tennessee, Sam Houston, join the race as well. Who will emerge victorious in this new nation's first election? So I think originally Sam Houston won. I think I'm not. I'm not entirely sure. I can't remember, but. Uh, yeah, so the only guy you can play as is Austin, uh, I think Houston was the one who won, though, but, uh, so Stephen F. Austin is the founder of Anglo-Texas, bringing, uh, 30 families and 300 families into the area in the 1820s. Austin would oversee the introduction of slavery into Texas and began attacks upon the native, uh, Karen Kokawa. In the early stages of the Texan, uh, Texas Revolution, Austin led a successful volunteer force during the siege of Bexar. Uh, now the father of Texas is seeking to become the nation's first popularly elected president. Austin has found himself running against Henry Smith, the former governor of the provisional government. So, yeah, you don't get a running mate here. Uh... Yeah, so, unfortunately, this has a lot of RNG, too, so I might be pausing a lot, but, uh, yeah. It has a soundtrack, but I'm not gonna play it, uh, so how will you respond to attacks against you for leaving Texas during the, its revolution? I have labored arduously for Texas, yeah, that's the only way I can do. So, you distance yourself from a controversial, uh, yes, uh, do you support potential American annexation of Texas? Uh, I'd say probably yes, how do, how do they feel? Yeah, they support it, so. Yeah, so you want to talk about the debt. So you're already in the lead. So earlier this year, uh, Santa Ana was captured. Uh, yeah. Okay, this one's an RNG event, so I'll, I'm just going to pause. Uh, okay. Okay, so that's the RNG. This is the RNG event, so... Archer, is, this is the best you can do. Full your support for his campaign. Uh, this one, your opponent... Um... Jesus Christ, another fucking RNG event. Okay, so... Yeah, just one... Okay, so the RNG event is done. Uh, yeah, I don't like this mod already because there's too many fucking RNG events. But And I know there's another one with Sam Houston later on, so it's bullshit anyway. Yeah, I mean, it's not a good idea. You got only 16 questions in the... I, I think this mod is actually... I mean, I know it's the first, like, non like another country but i mean it's done terribly i mean there's like four rng questions 
it's crazy. Like, totally unnecessary. I just gotta say that. It's not done correctly. Like, okay, I, I got it all now, so... Texas has incurred... Uh, probably Homestead Act. Got interrupted again, like I always do, so... Popular proposal... Um, yes... Um, what should we do? Yeah, don't strike deal with the Indians. Uh, Homestead Act. Yeah, I say I support it. For further improvements. Yeah. Uh, this is the other RNG event. One sec. So I just tried to do this RNG event for like forever. Um, yeah. Uh, this mod sucks. I just got to say that. I mean, it's interesting, but I mean, just way too many RNG. It's, it, it went way too far. I think this is probably the most amount. The McGovern mod is also bad for that, but this is just terrible. Like, I don't know. I don't know why the developers do this, like, it should just be about skill, like, there should be at least just one event, not, like, 15, like, it's, it's out of control, but that's my opinion, this video is probably gonna look like a, like a Frankenstein monster. Okay, so, attempt negotiations, okay, so that, that whole event didn't even make any sense, okay, so... Uh, no war with Mexico. I can't remember this one. I can't fucking remember. Okay. I don't, it's not the second one. I don't think it is. Maybe it is the second, I don't remember, see? Okay, it is. Yeah, I'm still winning, so. Uh, ability. How hard will you see? Okay. Yes, yeah, just wait. There's not enough questions, and there's way too many RNG events for the amount of questions. It's not good. The soundtrack also is kind of annoying. It just starts playing. Like, anyway. So, congr yeah, congratulations. Uh, so, Father of Texas will be the first popularly elected president. Thomas J. Rusk is being erected, elected alongside you to the position of Vice President. A nation in debt has voted largely in favor of U.S. annexation. Indians out west may be planning an attack, and there is always going to be the threat of a Mexican invasion. You have a difficult job ahead of you. Good luck, Mr. President-elect. So, yeah. I don't know about this mod. This is probably not... This is probably the worst one I've played so far. Uh, 
Yeah, just just very minimal amount of questions. Like, I don't know. I don't find it very engaging. It's just pure luck getting some of them. I don't know. I don't know about this one. I mean, it's interesting for the first one. It's not like about the U.S. Like, technically in other country, it's interesting, but I don't know. Like, besides that, I'm not sure about this, but anyway. I'll see you guys later. This video is probably going to look like a gigantic Frankenstein monster because of the amount of pauses I've had to have, but, uh, yeah. I'll see you guys later.